Hey everybody, welcome to my live. I'm Sarah Page Gruber, also known as Creative Sarah, and I have a very special Christmas Eve Eve creation for you. And it has nothing to do with Christmas. Well, it does, actually. I lied. It actually, I'm making a gift. Um, last minute, no uh, surprise there. And so I'm just checking out my five-year-old who is um, eating a go-gurt instead of going to bed. So, well, hello, hello, Ardelia, Melissa, Nancy, Kathy, Tia, Cindy, whoop, whoop, from Jackson, Louisiana. Well, it is cold up here in Michigan. It's probably slightly warmer where you are, I'm hoping. So I'm going to show you what we're doing today. And um, like I said, this is a gift. I need to get my ducks in a row. You guys always know or I'm going to get myself in trouble. So um, let's go ahead and share my screen with you. Okay, so I have, ooh, I'm, let me edit this. It's a little bit bigger than what I usually do. There. Make myself slightly smaller. Okay, I wish I could do that with just a button. Make myself a little smaller. I'm just going to share my video into my chalk nation group so everybody can see it okay there so you can see my board here now this is a very this is just kind of a distressed and um it looks like old barn wood it's smooth as smooth could be 55 degrees and clear skies. Nope, not too bad. So this is just, so you can see what this looks like. Looks like a piece of barn wood, right? This is just a piece of pine wood, which I stained. And you can see my fingerprints. I will never be able to commit a crime. So you can see my fingerprints on the back. But on the front, so I stained this and then um, I had used it for something else, so I washed everything off, and then I took some chalky paint, some uh, off-white, it's actually called cotton white paint, and I painted over it. I kind of washed it, like I rubbed it around with a paper towel, just kind of whitewashing it on. Then I sanded it, added a little bit more paint, wiped it again, and then I waxed it. So all of the layers are going to be what they are. This is going to be a family sign, and we're going to add some fun burlap and some little cotton. So this should be really cute when I am finished with it. Oh, I forgot to tell you the most important exciting piece. We're going to do a little background of the buffalo plaid. Now, in order to do, in order to maintain what I feel, what I wanted to do, we are not doing the entire background buffalo plaid. We're actually going to do um, parts of it and then we're gonna distress and sand off some. So it's gonna be buffalo plaid for a bunch of this, but some of this is gonna not have it. So I'm going for a technique. Hi, good evening, Cynthia. All right, so um, we'll start with this. And I'm gonna flip it over. It's kind of, um, I'm just gonna, I know it's, it's kind of already very well used. You guys know I use this a lot. 
You gotta drink the rest of this. Okay. I kind of, I kind of don't even want it straight. And we're going to do this in a light, light color. Um, fawn will be my, fawn will be my color of choice. And then we're going to dry it and Oh, I have no, oh wait, yes I do. Like I have no tools. Okay, let's get this nice and stirred up. Notice the end that I'm using inside my, um, the end that I'm using in here is the crooked end because look at what I can do when I have just a little bit left. I can really scrape that up and I'm gonna need to use a lot of this and I'm just gonna kind of plop it down. <sighs> I feel like my, I have used this so much, but we're gonna go ahead and use the four inch And it's making all kinds of squeaky noises. I'm just kind of moving this around. Now, because of the look that I'm, I want, I'm not, you guys are gonna be like, this broad is a crazy chick. I don't really want to hit every place on this. I am gonna do some, um, I am going to do some sanding so I know it will get distressed anyway, but I'm definitely not finishing the entire thing. I'm going to do parts of this down here. Okay. That's got my fingerprint. <clears throat> Looks good, hopefully. Peel this off. Now, some of the edge is meant to be, you know, like I said, it's definitely not meant to be perfect. Like I'm not doing a perfect buffalo plaid. It's gonna be a little haphazard and that's what I want. So I, I'm gonna dry it and then we are going to, oh, where's my dryer? Right here. I am going to dry it and to sand the edges because I really want that distressed look. So you guys cannot see everything I'm doing. Here we go. So we want to get this dry. That's the most important thing. Oh, yes, yes, yes. The Pampered Chef Scraper is awesome. Definitely. Hi, Thelma. Hi, Tika. Hi, Jana. Hello, Christy. Okay, so we're getting there. I definitely don't want any of the layers of this to be wet when I do that sanding. And then after I do the sanding, I'm going to do a little layer of wax over this because, you know, that's my, um, my little trick. There. Now I can sit here and still be in the picture. Okay. That looks pretty good. I'm going to grab my sander. 
and just kind of get to sanding these edges. Sorry if you're not, if you don't like the sound. I know some people are like that. Especially with the stripes of this. Okay, I think, I think that looks awesome. I'm going to clean this up a sec. I'm going to use one of my microfiber towels. Works so well. And I'm going to use the same towel. off of here what do you guys think ooh awesome Tika he'll help you no worries okay so we have our background done now I did tell you I was going to do a little wax wasn't lying so I'm getting my wax out. Okay. Hi, Jessica. Hey, girl. Happy Christmas, Christmas Eve. Okay. Now, I'm doing this for a couple reasons. First, because I'm layering over this with another chalk um, with another transfer but second because I roughed it up with the sanding I want to make sure I really seal this background in in place I don't want any of those you know loose particles to pull up even though it would look okay with my design I, I want to kind of keep it in place um, so this, Kathy, is a microfiber cloth. It is a generic version of a Norwex cloth. I got like, oh gosh, like a 24 pack on Amazon for like super inexpensive. I don't really know exactly how much. So yeah, we are just sealing in this background and remember I'm making this as a gift so I want to take extra precaution just to make sure it's going to last okay so there we have our board okay hi Debbie hi Sadie Hi, Cynthia. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I try. I'm definitely okay. Excited to see how this pans out for me. Um, I was thinking of doing colors. Cha cha cha. Um, I gotta see. So I was. I was debating, I think I'm gonna do black for my words so that they stand out. I was I was debating um, storm and I'm I just feel like it won't it won't stand out enough. So I think we'll do black and then like I said we're adding some of this other stuff. And I do I don't want brown, I want black or gray. Ah, gotcha, 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 gotcha. Okay, so, oh my gosh. You guys, this is why we write back on the back of our transfers. Because this very special, wonderful transfer, 
was used by somebody. Could have been me, but it was it was put on the wrong side of the oh, I'm ripping it. I'm going to cry. Of course it is 2 days before Christmas. <laughs> oh, I'm going to cry. Do not make this mistake. I do it, I, I forget to write back because I can tell. I can tell what the sticky side is. But not everybody. Okay. Now, look what I got. I got this hot mess of a transfer. B A C K. Oh, good. B A C K. Sometimes, um, whew, crisis averted. Now, let's figure this out. The word, no, I'm not going to put it in water. I'm good. I'm good. I'm going to get. The word is going to go up here, but I want it straight on, not on the diagonal. And I want to hold on because this, I just want to measure the, okay, so that's going to be here and this will be going over. So I kind of want it maybe even over slightly centered between those two things but still when a, with enough room yeah that will be fine maybe bring it down just a tad now I'm looking and it's totally a I'm gonna take this off Okay, it looks to be pretty straight on. Now I just work on, ooh, I'm so nervous. Okay, black, now we need black. Where's my black? Here it is, here it is. Okay, let's stir it up. Girls, let's get this done. my trusty angled squeegee. Angled squeegee for the win, I hope. And because I'm going over this and I'm going over stripes and solids, I'm kind of doing it slightly thicker than normal. Moment of truth, everybody. Ooh. Check it out. Check it out. Cynthia, 100% agree with you. Hi, Gerilyn. Hi, Donna. Merry Christmas. I truly, truly, truly... <laughs> Um, I've been stressing over what I'm doing for this. It's for my sister-in-law. Okay, so it's not so it's not like my sister who I know well. You know what I mean? 
it's not for someone it's for my sister-in-law and um I hope she likes it that's all I can tell you I don't think she's on Facebook so she won't see it unless someone shows her which no one would do that everyone would keep it a surprise I don't even think they know about my page like I don't think they watch me okay so it should be fine it should be totally fine um, let's dry this I'm trying to wave it dry with my hand okay now we're gonna put this on which is um, kind of long but it will still work I could make it shorter by taping off and moving it ooh maybe I'll try that oh my gosh you guys don't hate me um, I don't think it will be this difficult I don't think it will be hard to just make it here and then yeah I think I can do this You know me, I'm always making complicated choices when something could just be as easy as pie. Okay. Okay, here we go. Yay, this actually makes me happy that I've chosen to do something more difficult. I just think it'll look a slightly better. Okay, now. Let's use the multi-tool. Dun, dun, dun. Perfect size every time. This is awesome. Perfect size. Trying not to get too close to my tape. It doesn't matter because I'm not doing different colors. Since it's the same color, something like this is actually hopefully going to be easy and hopefully work out the way I want it to. Hi Cheryl, hi Joyce, hi Hope, hi Anne. Okay, so we've reached the end. Gorgeous. Now, I'm going to peel that. I do. I'm just going to stick this right here. Dry this. I know you guys can't see the words um, from how far away you are, but I will lift it up and show you because they're pretty fine. But they definitely show up really, really well when you're right here in person. Now we need love, trust, care about right under 
the A. A, there we go. We're just going to do care about. <clears throat> it's a little close. But that's okay. Next. <clears throat> We're going to do and so it's gonna go right below the P. There's the P. What, I'm still alive, yes. harder than I thought, but I can handle it. That is going up. All right. I'm, hold please. I need to get, this is, this was not planned. So that's why I don't have my tool over here. I'm running to get it. It is very close. Yes, this laser level is cool, isn't it? Yep, the laser is handy. Okay. I'm not, I'm just going to have to do it because I'm stressing. Maybe these words need to go down, go up a little. No, it looks like my laser. I'm just gonna, I'm trying to line them up, but, okay. Oh, it can't touch the other, see, I think I'm going a little bit too close to those other letters. The laser level. All right, we're just going for it now. I'm happy if it's totally messed up. I don't know what I can tell you. 
We're going for it. I need to clean this off and get a little extra. I'm stopping at other. Okay. Now, okay, so there's not that big of a space after the um, thing, but that's okay. Now I know what I'm doing. I'm gonna dry this and fit the rest of the words. I think I can do it without this. Rest. Hi, Joyce. Hi, Don Marie. Hello, hello. We're doing a fun, gifty. Okay. Now, this is lined up perfectly because I, I, well, no, no, it's not. No, no, it's not. Now it is. I lined up the letters with the row above it and then so I should have done that before but I, I wasn't wasn't on top of things but now I am okay It's getting there. <clears throat> so this transfer is the home and family transfer. And then Okay, broken, cannot be broken by any means. Nope, I'm just gonna go ahead and make this a there. Broken by any means. Okay, this should be awesome. And almost done. Super excited. Okay. Now. Peel. Awesome. And even if it's a little wonky, remember this is a distressed looking board. And so wonky is kind of kind of what I wanted, right? So because we're putting some stuff over here. So let's go ahead, get this transfer soaking. I don't know if any of that chalk will come off. We got black chalk. Let me clean this up and we'll do some decorating. Very excited to get this project finished. Okay, I can put this away. Let's make sure it's dry before I start messing around with it. Hi, Amanda. Okay, now I'm going to Take some of this and I'm 
I probably shouldn't do. You guys know me. I don't do bows, right? It needs to be tighter, though. That's for sure. Because I'm going to... Where's my... Probably going to need to do a little hot glue. Um, in order to make sure that it's tight. All right, because I know we're putting this here. All the stress, all the stress. Okay, and then I'm going to probably try to get this over on this side. Cut scissors, scissors, cut, 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 that's what I need. Okay. Do you guys do anything in particular with burlap ribbon? so that it doesn't fray too much or do you just leave it? Because being frayed is like the whole point. Just curious. What do you guys do? What's your... I was thinking about throwing in a little like a tall one like just a sprig of this I really like these colors together all right this is I like how this is this is wrapped you know some of the stuff that I get is like cheaply put together and then some of the stuff I love because it is not cheaply put together and it's like done better. Just, it just is, oopsies. That isn't going to, gotta untwist it. Untwist. Oops. Oh, geez. <laughs> that is not for me. Okay, so I'm going to twist this around. Put that back. Open this up because I love these colors. It just adds another little bit, whether those things go together or not. Oh, I don't care. They're pretty. And I just need to look at it. Okay, so now I'm going to hot glue. And it needs to be kind of over... Trying not to burn myself. Desperately not to burn myself. Oh, 
I think it's gonna be good. Thank you, thank you, Joyce. Spray seal it. Yes, probably um, I could do that on the family and everything. Yes, 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 I could. Those things. Okay, I'm gonna make sure it's not moving. I really need a nice glue gun. Awesome, I'm so excited. I think I finished it. Okay. Okay. All right. Let me. Sometimes if you hold it up. What do you guys think? Do you like it? I like it a lot. You can see, you can see the definition, you can see everything. I think it's really cool. I hope she likes it. That was awesome. Did you and your family have fun? We did, Rosemary, it was amazing. Oh, the donut. I can't, he's a little spoiled boy. I can't help it. One time I got him a donut at a gas station. One time. And when I, when you say you have a surprise for him, he gets this preconceived notion of what it's going to be. And then, you know, wants to like throw a whole fit when it's not what it is. Usually that's because he wants a toy not a donut <laughs> uh, but he was very happy actually he was he was a good good sport um, Ryobi cordless glue gun for cordless <gasps> I want like I want a glue gun that you know the ones that have like the stands and everything so it doesn't fall over all the time that's what I, I do. I just really, and I just really want, I want an awesome glue gun and I, I don't have one. And, but I'm excited for my family thing. And I know I probably have something crooked, but I don't really care. It is what it is. I think it looks cool. So anybody watching who is needing my information all of it is there if you are a customer and you are not in my group type in add me so that you can get into my chalk nation so that you can get all of my specials and everything right there firsthand if you are not or you're interested in doing what i do like what i just did here and you want to make money creating, type the word join and I'll tell you all about it. So, all right, thank you everybody for watching. I appreciate you so much. Have an amazing rest of your Christmas Eve Eve. Have an amazing Christmas Eve and Christmas and uh, love to you all. Spend time with your loved ones, have an amazing time and I will be back with you soon, bye.